Hey guys, so um, I am going to talk to you today about booking parties. Um, so I use two different games that I found online. Um, I use, it's called the dice game. And then another game I use is called the balloon game. So for the dice game, I found that these, I've tried so many different other party ideas, like try to book a party type game ideas. And none of them have really done anything for me. Um, so I, I really found that these two games definitely did kind of grow my business more. Um, so the first booking game I want to tell you about is the dice game. <clears throat> so the dice game is great. You have 11 note cards. And I have mine in like... Hold on, I'll show you. I have mine in little kind of folders. So I take, um, I got these, I wanna say at like Michael's, I think I got them at, I, I got them a while ago. Um, so I got these at Michael's and inside I, I took actual big note cards and I cut them in half and they fit perfectly in here. Um, so I will, I'll try to find the link and I'll put the link in the, in the um, video. <clears throat> but I use 11 of these and I number them every, I num number them all two through 12. So <clears throat> in number two, I have a grand prize. Um, so like a big prize that you can win. Um, numbers three, four, and five, I have win a prize. So it can be like something little or something medium, depends on what you wanna do. <clears throat> um, from six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and 11, I all have book a party. And then on 12, I have win another prize. Um, so basically, you have two dice. They, they roll the dice. So you, that's why you don't have a one because you have two dice. And if you get one and one, it's obviously two. Um, <coughs> so you have them roll the dice. They pick a card with the number that they rolled on the dice. And if the card says win a prize, they get to choose a prize from your gift basket. So like I always like pre-order a bunch of stuff and then I have a basket of so if I do live parties like you'll see the basket I have of just like different items um, and if I don't have the physical item in stock yet when I have a party um, I just have a picture of the item like this is what you win and it'll get shipped out to you um, and then if it says book a, a book a party they must book a party um, and then for those of that book a party, you obviously want to tell them what the host's rewards are and that there is no obligation that they have to book a party. Um, but I always say like, well, you want to book a party, like, why don't we book a party for you? It doesn't have to be in person. It can be online. Um, or it can be a mobile party. Like I give you a bunch of catalogs, you take them to work. Um, and then you can kind of just kind of gauge on how how they feel about it and obviously follow up with them within the next couple weeks if they want to continue with it uh and then there's a card that says grand prize they get a gift and they book a show so i usually for my grand prizes depending on how much the party is that we're currently at that's what i gauge my grand prize on so if the party's at like a thousand dollars I'll gauge my prize on like something bigger so that way they're like oh well I got my friend got this and booked a party when she got the grand prize so hmm that's a good idea um so that's that is my dice game booking a party and then we have my balloon game um so the balloon game so when I when people come to do the physical party I give them balloons just like cute little balloons like from like the dollar store and within the balloons they have notes um so they have notes ranging from um different prizes they won um like discounts off uh free shipping that kind of stuff <clears throat> and so basically it kind of creates a curiosity like what are in these balloons like what do i have do i have what do i have a gift do i have a percentage off do i have free shipping um, so I don't let them look at what they have until, um, 
like the party's kind of almost over. So they must book a party to see what they received. So the way that I go about that is like, if I'm talking to them and, they, and they, they're like, yeah, well, I'll book a party, it needs to have that date down on paper and um, then they can receive the percentage off, the free shipping, the gift. And once the, that party's over, just remind them that you did receive that percentage off because you booked a party. Um, so even if your party is $200, that's the minimum for a party, then that's still a party and that's still, you'll still get a hostess gift from me. Um, so if you don't hit your like level of receiving gifts from the company, I personally send out a hostess gift. And that's because you actually took the time, you helped me grow my business, so here's a gift for you. And I also normally do referral gifts as well for people that kind of do the games with me. But those are the two booking games that I found very helpful and I hope that they help you as well.